some ice. Hello and welcome to my ice bucket challenge. Uh, thank you very much to Caroline and my mother for the nominations. Um, unfortunately, I'm not able to do an actual ice bucket challenge because I had my wisdom teeth taken out today, this one and this one, yeah. and I've been advised that it's probably not a good idea to pour an extreme temperature over my head. And Anyway, instead I've decided that I will do a rice crispy challenge, a Asda Smart Price rice challenge, uh, a extra ice mint challenge, a, this is paprika, a spice challenge, an iceberg let's ice challenge, and a chocolate mice once, and twice, and thrice challenge. So let's put them all in, shall we? Good morning and uh, welcome again to my Ice Bucket Challenge. Um, as you can see, we're out on the beautiful uh, Yorkshire Dales. It's, uh, it's absolutely wonderful. Okay, if you haven't already, donate text to 770 ICE55 and then the amount you wish to donate. Even a very small amount, a pound or two, something you'd spend on lunch, make a huge difference. I myself and my family have been recently um, touched by motor new, neuro disease. Um, we had a beloved grandmother who me, my brothers and my cousins affectionately referred to as Graham, who unfortunately towards the later stages of her life did suffer quite greatly from motor neuro disease and eventually died on the 30th of May 2008. So it is a real illness, it's something that really does affect people and any donations are appreciated. Anyway, that's the boring stuff out of the way. Now you get to see me covered in all manner of things rhyming with ice. So, without much further ado. Oh, that's not nice. <laughs> the ice is thin, come on, dive in. Underneath my lucid skin. 